Hello there, ladies and gentlemen. Punky Cook here, aka the Lonely Achievement God. Today I'm going to bring you the pause glitch for Wilmot's Warehouse just by itself. It's not going to be a very long video. I'm not going to go into any of the excruciating detail. If you would like to see that, I have a full playthrough using the pause glitch where I will explain everything. This is just for people who want to know what the pause glitch is and uh, want to piece it together and how to use it uh, on their own. So you're going to go ahead, start a game in any slot. Uh, slot 1 is the best for this, uh, but I am currently using slot 1. So just to demonstrate uh, this this, uh, well, it's not so much a strategy as it is a glitch. But to dis to show off this, we're going to go and start a new game. You can use uh, whatever settings you want. I play alone because I have no friends. We're going to do normal mode. Expert mode does not matter because you are skipping everything. So the settings don't matter. Settings. Settings don't matter. Start up a game. Skip the tutorial. Uh, so, you're going to start off with a delivery phase, which you can always skip in any playthrough. All you have to do is, once you get through this, press A, press Start. When we come back into the game, you'll notice the time clock has its punch card, and we can skip the delivery phase. Now, this is where the fun begins, because no one else has, uh, to my knowledge, discovered this. If you... Stay in the time clock box at the beginning of the service phase. Go ahead and ignore one. He's being annoying. Press start. In the bottom right hand corner, you will see that the game has saved. And now you are going to exit to the menu. Find the save slot that you have started. Uh, that's why it's easier to use slot one because the cursor automatically goes there. But it's not a big deal to go down to slot 2, load up slot 2, spam A through all of this, tell them you're ready like Spongebob, and press A once again. This skips the service phase, giving you three stars for completing the phase in, uh, before the 30 second mark, and CJ is disappointed in you. Because none of the customers were happy, it kind of glitches the game out, the game recognizes you completed the phase but uh it also <coughs> excuse me you also uh tell the game that you didn't get any of the stars from customers go ahead tell cj you're sorry it does not matter you do not get penalized for doing this uh, you can go through the entire game as i've I've done so in the, the other videos on my, my channel here. Once you do, you can get here. Uh, there's not much else to it. That is the pause glitch. Basically in its entirety. You can just uh, skip through all the phases. I will show you real quick how to do it very quickly. a bing we're done you can get through the entire game if you aren't focusing on sorting items or getting any groups in about 20 minutes which makes this extremely useful for say the last grouping that you need if you've had uh poor luck trying to get the boxes that's all i'm gonna do in this video guys uh if you're looking for a lot of information about it i have an entire video playthrough where i used the pause glitch to uh not only get achievement groupings, but go through the entire game. You can check that out and get a lot more information. I also have the info for this uh, method on my website. So go ahead and check that out as well. If you have any questions or comments, you know, let me know. I'll be more than happy to answer. I appreciate you guys checking uh, out my videos, and I will see you next time.